This lesson covers how to build a closed loop transfer function using the feedback command in MATLAB. So here's our system. We're given G, we're given H. We want to figure out what the closed loop transfer function is. Let's see how to do that. We'll put in first build G and build H and then we'll see what we can do with the feedback command. So G equals TF two, three, four, six, one, eight, one, five, ten. There's G. H equals TF one, 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 four, five. There's H. We have G, we have H. Let's type help feedback. Feedback connection of two linear time invariant models. Feedback sys1 and sys2 computes the closed loop feedback system. Negative feedback is assumed. If you want positive feedback, you actually have to add a plus one. So the default is negative feedback, and you, all you need to do is put in sys1 and sys2. All right, so we have that. We have sys1 is G, sys2 is H, and we have negative feedback. So to get the closed loop transfer function, closed loop transfer function equals feedback G comma H. And it's that easy. That completes this lesson.